this is Nutsy Cuckoo, and I'm going to show you how to do a green screen effect in Final Cut Pro or Express. First, you need your green screen clip, which I have a green screen clip here with a box as the object. I gra grab that and drag it down to my Video 2 timeline. Drag that here. I am going to delete my audio because I don't need it. So here's my clip, just a simple, and I did miss some of the green screen as you can see here, which is going to show up. So here, I go to my effects tab, chroma key, drag that to my green screen clip. Double click my green screen clip, you see chroma key up here. I click that, and now I need to select the green in this box here, to key out the green screen. I have some of the lighter green, so I need to get that too. And you can, it's easier to get too much and trim it down later than have not enough. So I bring the saturation and the luma I usually do all the way. Now you can kind of preview the clip and make sure you see no green. I did pretty well with this. Some people, if you don't have enough light, you'll end up with some problems. You have to make sure it is lighted well your area. So now I go back to my project and I drag it to my image below the clip. Here it is, my image. Now I'm going to extend my image some because it's not long enough. So there is the green screen clip. So I'm going to just cut, I'm going to drag that actually down a little and trim that. I'm going to add an edit into this. This is just so you can see that the differences in the clips. And I'm going to remove the chroma key from that. So there, I'm going to render this. Render all, both. And it renders pretty fast. And there, our render is done. So we bring the playhead back to the beginning, and we start. So you're starting at this, and you're going to this, all in a matter of seconds. And the background image can either be an image or a movie. In this case, I'm using an image. This is a tutorial by Nutsy Cuckoo. Please subscribe. Thank you.